All right, let's go to the Chrome apps and then go to the web store and then search for Chrome Developer Editor. I already have it installed, but it'll say Add to Chrome and just click that and it'll do its thing. Note that this is a, a developer preview, so it doesn't work completely right, but it's the easiest thing to use, I find. And then we're going to create a new project. We have to choose a folder to put it in. I'll just put it in documents for now. And then we're going to, we'll just call this Hello World Dart. And for the project type, we're going to pick a Dart web app. And it'll load a sort of custom template for us. Now you can see here, it says all the dependencies. So what happens if we try to run it is it says, no, 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 you don't have any, any of those dependencies. So it'll still open the program, but the uh, the JavaScript, um, the Dart compiled to JavaScript won't be running. So you see, it doesn't do anything. It just loads the HTML. So how you get those dependencies is you use pub get. Um, so if we run that right now, it won't actually work because we haven't installed pub. It'll It'll just say getting packages, and then it'll it'll just go on forever and eventually sputter out, which uh, I'm not a big fan of. So let's do that. Let's get pub. Um, so open command prompt, and let's run it as administrator, and then run this command. This is to install Chocolatey. Um, it's a long command. I'll just include it in the description. Again, remember you run it as an administrator. And then once that installs we can again open up command prompt I shouldn't close that run it as administrator and then go choco install dart software development kit or dash sdk and then that'll install and then that'll give us pub and we're gonna write yes we agree to sell our firstborn child or whatever it wants from us okay and that'll install and that'll be nice Everything is okay. All right, good. So it's still getting the packages. So let's just let's close this and try again from scratch here. It'll just open our last project. I'm pretty sure. Yep. So again, if we try to run it, it's not going to work. We don't have those packages. So we can run pub get, but as I said, this is a, a preview, so I don't think it's working quite right because I've never had this be successful. It just goes on forever, so let's let's manually run pub get using the command prompt. Um, so that's the folder that we installed it in. So let's just get that file name. Again, open command. Everybody shouldn't be closing it, and then just write CD, go to this directory, and then write pub get. And you'll see it'll get all those packages for us. Rather, it will resolve the dependencies. Okay. Come on now. All right, good. So you can see this; it's still getting the the packages here. So, but now, if we run it, you'll see it'll load. And one of the things I really like about the uh, the Chrome Developer Editor is it creates the server for you. You can see that we don't actually have to manually create that every time. And now, if we run use this program after it builds, which takes a little bit of a long while, but not super long, it'll run. And so now you have the sort of the skeleton from which you can edit and create your Dart program.